I'm Karen and I'm one of the science facilitators here at Science World. Today we're going to be talking about the science behind balloons. I have two balloons here. One is filled with air and one is filled with water. We're going to be doing something called the fireproof balloon test today. So I'm going to first of all put the air filled balloon over a candle here. We're going to let the candle heat up the balloon and see what happens. Oh! It pops! And the reason that it pops is because air is a very poor conductor of heat and it also has a very low heat capacity. So we're going to try this again with the water-filled balloon. Maybe we can take a second to think about what might happen with the water-filled balloon. We saw what happened with the air-filled balloon. It popped because of its low heat capacity. Do we think that the water-filled balloon is going to do the same or do we think that something different might happen. So let's test this out. So this balloon isn't popping. And the reason why, even though it's getting pretty warm on the rubber, is because water is a very good conductor of heat. And it's got a heat capacity about four times that of air. What that means is that it takes about four times as much heat from the outside to heat up the temperature of water. So this is a fireproof balloon.